Hello guys, it's this is Undercover Racer One, and welcome back to another Morrowind video. Now, last game or last time, I was given a quest to go eliminate some cave rats, and it's thunderstorming. And I can barely hear myself speak through my headset microphone because it's so loud. I think this is their house right here. Let's get inside. Jesus, it's so loud. Oh, that's better. All right. Hello. Yes, it's you. Speak, traveler. I can hear the rat walking. Are you the one they said to take care of the cave rats? Yes. These rats are such a nuisance. I'm worried they'll eat all my pillows. You like pillows, don't you, Undercover Racer 1? Anyway, I've got one trapped in my bedroom here. The other two are in my storage area upstairs. Rats, that is, not pillows. Here's a key for that door. There are at least three of these beasts. I hope I haven't gotten into my good pillows. Crazy pillow lady. Alrighty. Die, rat. <laughs> rat taken out. Well, that was easy. I wish I had the staples easy button. Upstairs now. Die, you nuisances. Such fails. They didn't know what hit them. Well, if they could talk, they might know it's a glass longsword, but, uh, they did not. And apparently, she's a crazy pillow lady, so where are her pillows? Uh, pillows. Uh, baskets of. Wow, that's 75 pillows right there. 76. Yeah, she's got a crazy number of pillows. Alright, let's go get our payment. Speak, traveler. Actually, first I want to go to bed. And her bed's full of pillows. Who knew? Alrighty. Hello? Speak quickly, Outlander, or go away. Alrighty. Well now, Undercover Racer 1, you're back again, and what can I do for you? Well, I took care of your cave rats. I'll take your word that the cave rats are dead. Here, take the 100 septums. It's at what I agreed to pay the Fighters Guild. Thank you, and have a nice day, miss. Alright, let's head back to the Fighters Guild. So, I got my payment. I'm gonna have to give them to the Fighters Guild. We'll see what they pay me. It's still massively thunderstorming. It's crazy weather here in Morrowind. <sighs> Much better. Head on. Yes, ma'am. Uh, the cave rats. So you killed the rats under Cave Racer One. Not bad for you. You ready for more orders? Hmm. So I get to keep the gold. Can I have an advancement? The Fighters Guild recognizes you, Undercover Racer One. You are now Undercover Racer One, the Apprentice. Well, looks like I've leveled up. What are my new orders? A local egg mine has problems with egg poachers, and you're going to solve those problems. About these egg poachers? Yes, egg poachers. May sound silly, but those qualm eggs are among the few things worth exporting from this nasty little province. Dram Barrow, the owner of Shulk Egg Mine, wants to make an example of these thieves to keep other miners from getting funny ideas. The egg poachers, Selvilo Orthan and Den Danila Valles are former egg miners and longtime local troublemakers. Can you hand you can handle that, can't you? Report back when the poachers are dead. Yes, ma'am. Right away, right away, ma'am. Okay. Well, I believe I'm prepared. Let's head to the mine. So, all I have to do is follow the river and we'll get to the mine. I hope this rain goes away. It's really loud and annoying. No, oh, it looks like there's still thunder. Ah, that's loud. For me, anyways. There's the bridge. 
seems the egg mine should be on the right here. Ah, looks like the rain's stopping. A couple little rumbles of thunder. Huh, this must be the mine. Are you the... Who are you? Hello? 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 I'm a miner in the Shulk Egg Mine, but I'm getting some fresh air. Egg poachers, have you heard of them? We haven't seen Sevilla Orthan or Danila Vallis, but eggs keep disappearing, and they know the place. It's easy for them to get in and out and stay out of sight. Hey, what's your trade involve? I'm a miner. Usually here on Vordenfall, being a miner means you're an egg miner. Uh, scrib jerky and scrib jelly, quama eggs and quama cuddle are the basis of our warden economy. Yes, those are more val- there are more valuables we take from the mines, such as bra, ebony, rock, glass, true wax, daedra skin, daedra hearts, diamonds, ash salts, and so forth. And that's good work too, but it's the egg miners that feed Morrowind, bring cash all over the empire. Little rumors? I've heard there's been some trouble at up at Force Frostmouse. Never heard of it? It's on an island called Solstheim, north of Wardenfall. Yes, Solstheim? That's the frozen island up north, right? Sounds awful to me. If you're looking to get there, you might check for transportation and cull. So that, that island's part of the expansion pack, in case you didn't know. Have a little advice for me? I've never seen a successful adventure where you didn't carry a couple of divine intervention scrolls with them on long expeditions. Two reasons. Emergency exit. And lets you move a lot more loot than you can carry on foot, and faster goes without saying. Little secret, the Quam Foragers and Warriors won't attack us, since they're used to our smell, but they attack intruders, and you smell like an intruder. But don't worry, the Queen squirts out Foragers and Warriors like seeds. If the Foragers and Warriors bother you, kill them, or run past, whichever is easier. But do us a favor, don't kill the workers. They don't bother you, and we don't need them to keep the ke queen uh, laying and the eggs ripening. Some more one lore? The great houses are always fighting each other in their great house wars. Uh, thanks for your advice. Alright. So, let's up. go in. But, I think I'll cut the video off here. Thanks for a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.